Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. It's Ashlina. So I need to give you some context on why I'm reacting to Beartooth. And if you're a Beartooth fan, hi, welcome to my channel. You must be new here because I've never listened to Beartooth before. And this is my first time listening to them. So the reason I am doing this album, full album reaction is because I'm going to see them um, in nine days. Yep. So I bought a ticket to Beartooth's concert because not only are they performing, but The Plot in You is there, Invent Animate is there, and Sleep Theory are there. And if you're new to my channel, you can go and check out my reactions to The Plot in You, Sleep Theory, and Invent Animate right now because they are live once this video is live. So I did buy the ticket not for Beartooth, obviously, since I've never heard them before. I am a big The Plot in You fan, and I thought it would be cool to just be like, hmm, should I just buy a ticket to go see the opener? Sure. Why not? Life's too short not to go to the show, right? And I'm going by myself, which, you know, life's too short not to go to a show by yourself because you'll miss out on shows if you don't go by yourself because there was only one ticket left. Anyways, doesn't matter. I'm very excited to listen to Bear Tooth, number one, because if I don't like them, I can leave early. <laughs> I'm old and I'm a mom, okay? Uh, number two, I have heard one song, I think Riptide. It came on once at the gym and I was like, what is this? And I kind of looked at the name and I was like, oh, cool, Beartooth. Put my noise canceling headphones back on so I don't ruin it. Uh, so I'm excited to hear this full album. Now, I do realize they're not going to be singing and playing all of these songs at their show. I'm sure they have a wide variety of songs from all their past albums as well that they'll be playing, but I don't have time to react to however many albums they have. So I'm literally just going to do their latest album. So this album is called The Surface, and I'm assuming this is their The Surface Tour because the album artwork is the exact same as the tour banners and posters. So... I'm excited to hear this. I, I honestly think I'm going to like them. I am so excited because I loved hearing Sleep Theory. They were amazing. That album, their EP is so good. Paper Hearts. Oh my God. Obsessed. For Invent Animate, I was blown away. I even had a subscriber tell me, listen, they're going to steal the show. And I'm like, honestly... I can see that happening because they are amazing. Like Invent Animate and the plot in you is like just heaven to me. Sleep Theory, not as heavy, but still such an awesome band. So I'm stoked to see them. I'm so excited. And then we're going to hear Beartooth and see how heavy this gets or not heavy. Um, I'm not really sure where this is going to go, but I am very thankful that all four of these bands are playing together like this is freaking amazing i'm so stoked all right so we're gonna get into the album the surface it's about it's only 37 minutes okay all right let's just hop into it if you guys need any more backstory feel free to check out my sleep theory my invent animate or my the plot in you reactions and just so you guys know i am reading the lyrics because when i'm listening to a band for the first time especially like a screamo screamy metal song I don't want to miss out on lyrics because I don't know what the hell he's going on about and so I tend to find that I like music more if I actually know what they're saying and it's helpful to learn the song quicker so that's what I'm doing if you're curious why my eyes are just scrolling back and forth while listening to this song okay so this song is called The Surface which is the self-titled album song cool <laughs> turn it up Yeah, there we go. All right. Laughing reckless, laughing fast, don't have time for regret. Might have pushed it to the limit, but I'm not dead yet. Drop it. Yeah! 
Nobody left. This is I was paradise. not expecting My that. Ice could be the end. Vitals are critical. The dark's creeping in. If this is do or die, it's time to start again. All my worries were a waste of time. Made the world so blurry. I was going blind. I can't find the seal like the others. Think that I just discovered a way to let you see. Yeah, you guys, I'm very honest on my channel. I didn't really like that song. I felt like it was very pop meets metal. Um, when the all the worries, like when that part kicked in, I was like, is this the right song? I honestly, I think it's just because I assumed listening to The Plot in You, listening to even Sleep Theory, and then listening to um, Invent Animate, that this was going to be similar to those bands, which it is. Like, it's, it's very, it's metal, but, like, I don't know. I really love the structure of this song. I really do. I think it's a good song. I think, and I'm going to tell you something real quick after this, I think I don't like the singer's voice. It sounds like he's struggling to scream, and I also don't really enjoy his singing voice. So maybe that will change in a different song. I never know. But here's the thing with me and bands. If I don't like the lead singer in the band, I will not listen to the band again. I just, it doesn't matter how good the band is. I just, like, as someone who used to be a vocalist, I really pay attention to vocals. And I have no problem with his screaming. It's just when he's singing, it's just, I don't know. I don't really feel it. I don't really, I don't really get anything from it. But that could change, so... Let's see. Let's go into Riptide. And this is the song I have heard like a little bit of, uh, you know, at the gym and whatnot, but I haven't fully listened to it. Finally frozen, no more emotion. Started escaping, now everything's numb. I'm so 
part. Like, the band is so good. Too pop for me. And I love pop music. I'm down explaining my pain. This is way too much. I want to feel you. Hurry up. Give me the rest. Cause it's the last time that I romanticize. The rip tie that's trying to drown me. honestly didn't expect them to be so like singy like so (laughs) they sound like a pop band that have been like you know those like pop goes punk that's what it sounds like a cover of a pop song and I feel like if sleep theory opened for them that would make so much sense because sleep theory is that it's obviously not the same whatsoever but sleep theory is very like uh like R&B pop like bluesy that's metal which is insane and I love it this is literally pop goes metal I don't know if I'm into it I had a feeling that I was like "Mm, what if I just don't like the main band like how odd is that I don't know I don't know what it is I do like their heavier parts it's just it's too boppy for me and that's weird because I love pop music like I have fucking Britney Spears sitting next to me, for God's sakes. But I don't know. Like, I'm not mad at this song. I've listened to it a couple times at the gym, and I've never been like, oh, turn this off or anything like that. It's just, I don't know if I'd listen to this on my own time. You guys know me. I always give bands, if you don't know me, I always give bands, like, at least three chances. And not three songs. Like, I will fully listen to a band like a full album, and then try other songs that people recommend. Say, hey, try this. You might like this album better or this era better or whatever. The, whatever. Um, I, I, I just don't understand how all these bands are playing one show when they're all so different. Like if In Van Animate and The Plot and You did a tour, I would get it. If Sleep Theory and Beartooth did a tour, I would get it. But all four... I swear to God, these bands better sing more than like four songs or I'm just going to lose my mind. (laughs) The show starts at 530. So if my ass is out of there before 10, I'm going to be so mad. (laughs) Oh, I really wanted to like every band at this show. Like that was my goal. My goal was to go to a show of a band I've never heard of because an opener I like, The Plot in You, is opening and I want to see them so bad. And so... I was like, I'm going to react to all of these bands before the show so I can love all of them and just have the best time. And now I love three bands that are playing and they're all openers. I'm not giving up yet. We still have a bunch of songs to go through. So this song is called Doubt Me. I have faith that this is going to get better. I've been used by the useless My whole body's covered in bruises Consumed by the clueless So full of lies and excuses I've let you take enough from me I'm jumping ship to watch you sink When you look back and I'm still standing Remember every time you Okay Feeling the song. It's a jam. Ooh. No, 
like it. Now you're gone with no choices. You might as well have been faceless. Exposed by your weakness. I'm getting back to the basics. The smoke is clear. I'm seeing red. I will stop fighting till I'm dead. When you look back and I'm still standing. Remember every time you me. Okay, so here's my problem. When he is singing like into his screaming singing voice i'm not really into it but like his singing to screaming voice works for me does that make sense his screaming to singing so for now you're gone without with no traces you might as well have been faceless that doesn't work for me but then when he's like i won't what is it it makes me stronger when he's singing like the part, remember every time you doubt me. Like, I like it. The singing to screaming works for me. But the screaming where it's like his voice is transitioning into singing, it sounds like he's struggling. I don't know. That's amazing. See this? Not into it. I'm jumping ship to watch you sink when you look back and I'm still standing. Remember every time you Like, I actually like that song. It's good. It's just, I really hope that made sense what I was saying. I really hope this is only one singer because then that's just, this makes way more sense. Doubt me, I'm okay with. Let's get into the better me. How many times have I said I was gonna be someone when I get back on to my feet? Tomorrow I'm gonna make changes because today I can barely speak. Okay, I figured it out. It's like country pop metal. It's just some, I don't know where these guys are from. <laughs> I should go find out where they're from. Hold on. They're from Columbus, Ohio. That's amazing. Okay. It says metalcore, hard rock, melodic, hardcore, hardcore, punk, pop, punk. Yep, that's 100% what they are. That makes a lot of sense. Corey Grow of Rolling Stone wrote that compared to Attack Attack, the smarter, leaner Beartooth have anteed up the aggression with poppy hooks and slinky, hardcore riffing. Uh, and then Justin Maybe of HM Magazine said, while much of the album, they're talking about the album Disgusting, tends to focus on two steps, thrash and hardcore, Shomo came from a place where catchiness was in every song. Yeah, this is literally like a pop metal band, which is strange because... Invent Animate are very heavy, and The Plot in You is pretty heavy, too. And then Sleep Theory is definitely not as heavy, but they're more like, I consider them like my R&B metal band, which is insane, because like, what other R&B metal band is there? Um, and then this is just like pop metal. I'm going to restart the song again. I didn't give it a fair chance. How many times have I said I was going to be someone when I get back on to my feet? Tomorrow I'm gonna make changes Cause today I can barely like speak like a country song I hate that part I've been burned by it Concerned about it I can't steady my hand The side effects of it does have a really so good voice though This wasn't part of my plan Yeah, this is like so country. But I'm back in the gutter, thinking all the same things. 
song is good, the guitars are great, the drumming is sick, it's the singing that's killing it for me. I don't want to listen to country metal. Love a guitar solo. so confused because this song sounds like it's from a completely different band like if i was listening to like a mixed rotating thing on spotify where they like you know they take your playlist and they insert other songs if this song came out i'd be like who the fuck is this and then i would see beartooth and i'd be like nah this is beartooth featuring hardy okay hardy is obviously um a country singer Right. Uh, Michael Wilson Hardy, known professionally as Hardy, is an American country singer and songwriter. He has written songs for Florida Georgia Line, Chris Lane, Blake Shelton, Dell Smith, blah, blah, blah. Listen, I love country music, okay? I'm not mad that this is a country song. It just doesn't really make sense. It doesn't make sense when you're a band to have another singer completely take over your song. This could have been on his album. Not sure if it is, but if it is, great. Didn't need to be on your album. Don't get me wrong. Sorry, I just sneezed like 10 times. I'm here for collaboration when it comes to bands and artists and things like that. But this just doesn't work for your album. Like, I'm not really sure where you guys are going. Like, are you pop punk? Are you like metalcore? Are you turning into country metalcore? Like, I don't know what's going on on this album. And I'm only like, what, three songs in? Four songs in? We're, we're not giving up. I never give up on a band. So Doubt Me was good. I'm okay with Riptide. The Surface and The Better Me are definitely not going on any lists and playlists that I have, but let's listen to Sunshine. Oh, wait, sorry. Let's listen to Might Love Myself. Yeah, Might Love Myself is next. Hold on. I know this song. This is another song that has played at the gym, and I'm not mad at this song, but it will be very interesting to hear it as a whole and it's also interesting to see how this song kind of works with the flow of that country song so maybe they're like flowing away it's like this will be more pop and then the next song will be a little bit heavier like we'll see how it goes think of my love mess Don't know how to take it Still chasing ghosts I feel so unsure And I sold myself a lie Still gave it one Cause we are ranging I'm out of my cage Breaking my spell Think of my Okay, I'm not mad at this I might love myself It's still very pop metal But I dig it
focused on the time, how I'm losing every minute. Gotta make a choice, gotta push it to the limit. Never felt better, never making an apology. I'm exactly who I wanna be! Yeah, it, like it, it's a catchy song. I'll I'll give them that. But um, yeah, I I'm just not a, I'm not a big fan of his voice. Um, I don't know. It's it feels like it feels like Simple Plan went metal. That's what I'm getting from this, and I'm so sorry. But like, I don't know. I'm just not a I'm not a big fan of his voice. Like he can sing. Don't get me wrong. It's just it's just not for me. People do not want me to, uh, no one's watching this anymore. I'm talking to myself now. Nobody's watching this, so I might as well continue because, like, they're they're realizing that mm -hmm, this bitch don't like my favorite band, so fuck her. <laughs> Let's listen to Sunshine. Uh, I'm, like, actually losing my voice, though. Killing my time in the dark inside, it's a race to death for me! This is the problem. Like, he even said it in the beginning of the song. He's losing his voice. Bro, go get a vocal coach and learn how to scream. There are screaming vocal coaches out there. He's not singing properly because it literally sounds like he's hurting himself. But I'm not your mom, do you, boo? Try and unwind while I lose my mind! I got no place like, this to is be. not cute. I might die if I what stay in this cold. Enough, finally admit it. I gotta be committed to let this story unfold. I hear angels calling my name in. I better listen before this song I sounds am very country, too. I don't care for a minute. If no one's gonna get it, let's try selling our souls. <laughs> oh, okay, this is a clever song. super catchy song um i feel like that will be a fun song live like I, I get it but again like i'm when am i listening to this probably never 
I just don't think I would listen to this on my own time, but I feel like it would be a fun song live. I think this band is going to be better live than they are on this album. That's the vibe I'm getting. I think this is the type of band that needs that crowd aspect where people are singing along at the right times and like the heavier parts, everyone's like, da, 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 you know, some like crowd surfing, all that good stuff. So the next song is called What's Killing You. This album, this album is killing me. Life's not fair, life's stay on a way. It's not worth living if we're living scared. Time won't wake if it all today. Tomorrow isn't always there. Fuck them up. The band is so good. Like, so good. I want to be in the moment, but the moment's past. I try to make it forever, but it never lasts. Remember all the stories, but they're fading fast. And now I can't stop staring at the photographs. Try to suppress the feeling. Put a void inside my mind Hopelessly pretending I always have more time Whoa! Don't know how to feel Nothing I can do It's killing me Seeing what's killing you Don't know what to think Can't believe it's true It's killing me Seeing what's killing you Like his voice is literally bleeding. Killing me, seeing what's killing you. I hope he has like can't believe I hope he's singing properly. It's killing me. It sounds like a what's killing you. Very catchy. It's killing me, seeing what's killing you. It's killing me, seeing what's killing you. I'm just going to be honest, like I'm what, halfway through this album? Yeah, I'm on song seven and there's only 11. So like we've made it over the halfway point. I just don't think this band is for me. I'm going to be completely honest. Like obviously they're catchy. Obviously they're like pop metalcore. Got one little country song on there. Um, I, I, I just, I can't get into it. I don't know what it is. And like, let's be fair. Like I won't just give up on this band. I'm going to listen to this album again and see if, you know, anything changes maybe this album takes a little time to get used to for me personally but yeah I don't know I don't know I think it's just the singer that's not doing much for me over here we're gonna listen to look the other way I just want one song that I love but then no it kind of I don't want one song that I love because then it's probably going to be a song they won't even play live and I'll be even more disappointed (laughs) so but I do kind of hope like I like a couple songs but here's look the other way I'm a sucker for an acoustic guitar that's for sure Barely afloat and we're taking on water 
filled shoes. Chasing the high that I felt the whole summer. Very country. Being buried alive with a smile on my face. A drink in my hand and a day to erase. I'm picking up the pieces. Please just look the other way. This song should have came after I'm that one. Picking up the pieces, song. please just look the other way. It would have made the album flow better. Is please just look the other way. I'm picking up the pieces, please just look the other way. Sounds good Not in the song. Falling asleep, wish my heart would beat slower. Thinking back on my year, wanna start it all over. I wake you up and I tell you I'm losing control. I'm barely surviving, but I need you to know. I'm picking up the pieces. You said you'll always be right here to keep me company. When I don't even love myself, you love me anyway. When I don't even love myself, you love me anyway. The shakiness in his voice, so cute. Okay, that's a gorgeous song. It was very pretty. I love the way he sang it. Even though I'm not the biggest fan of his voice, I still think he nailed the song. It felt like there was a lot of emotion in this. The lyrics were really, really, like, good. It's just, it's such a sad song. But that's probably my favorite song so far off this whole album. Also, I'm just, look, I'm looking at the timestamps of all these songs, and they're all, like, three minutes and whatever. These are really short songs. The next song is called What Are You Waiting For? And now I have Gwen Stefani stuck in my head. What you waiting, what you waiting, what you waiting for? And it's so funny because he was saying in that song, um, even though I don't love myself, you love me or whatever the lyrics were. And in the other song, he's like, I think I might, <laughs> I think I might love myself. <laughs> I feel like the order of these songs are not the best order. I would have moved some things around, but that's just me. Do you fit in your skin? Do you want to start over again? Do you get what you give? Do you want to start over again? Come on! Honestly, not a bad song. Um, it's <laughs> it's just so many little surprises in there, like that a little acoustic ending. It was cute. And then when the woes kicked in, I was like, 
whoa they were much louder than the other woes in the song so it was just like a shock but yeah it was okay it was all right i'm not mad at that song okay let's listen to my new reality i feel like the last couple songs on this album are the best songs on this album for me Went down cause I waited Fished out on the pavement Tore the river one more night Guess I'm just persuasive Blood stains on my stainless Wore it out, I'm shameless Check my wrist, I'm out of time Why I got no patience Floating on the wave till it's breaking Never change the ride, keep the challenge till I make it. Got everything in front of me. Turning up my life, don't need no condolence. Manifest my best until I'm dead. Living like I got more life behind me than I killed for that to be like a really long outro yeah i actually like that song i like what he's saying his lyrics are good i'm i'm just so confused because this album feels like it's all over the place for me but like the last couple songs i'm like hmm, okay i'm into this i like this song that's a great song i was just listening to attack attack and i was like yep i remember this band very well i dig them they're great okay let's get into the last song on the album it is called i was alive <laughs> Not gonna be on my deathbed Knowing I'll be buried in regret oh, that's cool. Thinking about the things I never did While I'm taking my last breath I right, take this No need to fear the end Cause I'll know I didn't just live When I die I'll know I didn't just live How was I alive? I'll know I didn't just live How was I alive? Alive? Okay. Not gonna be on my day I'll know I didn't just live Okay, so this song has a great melody to it. It's just, when I die, I know I didn't just live. I was alive. I just don't really get the lyrics, but, like, I get it. I get what he's saying, but it's just like, mm, okay. Because I know I didn't just live. No need to fear the end, cause I know I didn't just live. No need to fear the end, cause I know I 
Let's sit and just live. When I die. Drake is so good in this song. Because he's singing to screaming, not screaming to singing. Okay. Not my favorite song from them lyrically, but not a bad song. It's super, super catchy. This is like they're a catchy band. They have some questionable songs for me, but overall they're okay. I don't know what to do for this show because it's like I'm going to stay for the whole thing. Like it's a Friday night. Okay, I'm going to stay for the whole show, but I'm I'm really curious because the tour starts this Friday, which is the 12th. And um, I'm going to look at the set list because I would like to know what they're playing so I can see if what songs from this album are going to be live. And then like I'll be more aware of what's going on with all of the bands that I'm uh, reacting to. So honestly, guys, I am I know if you're Beartooth fans and you're watching this, you're probably disappointed that I didn't really get into it as, as much as I thought I was. But like, that's life. I'm happy you like them. Um, and I'm okay with not their, them not being like something that kind of was just like, oh my God, I love this band. Like, that's fine. They're still good. It's just not something I'm probably going to listen to on my own time. Again, I will be seeing this band on the 19th along with The Plot in You with Sleep Theory and Invent Animate. And um, I have reactions to all three of those bands as well. So please go check them out. Um, my vinyl of the day is Spirit Box. I just got this vinyl two days in the mail, so I haven't even opened it yet. It is the Fear of Fear EP. I did a reaction to this on my channel literally the week I purchased this <laughs> and fell in love with the EP and decided that I wanted to have it in my vinyl collection. So that is why it's here. If you like heavy metal, uh, screaming and singing, go check out Spirit Box. The lead singer is female and her name is Courtney and she is flipping awesome. Like awesome. So please go check them out. Thank you guys so much for watching. Be nice in the comments. Ugh. So disappointed that like I don't like this band.